Okay, Lisa, he's waiting for his chance. Um, he's been eating all his hay, he's doing good, and I've done everybody, he's the last one. So, isn't that cute? He's just waiting. So, we'll be back in a minute to get him. Okay, so here we go, arena's closed, no round pending, and we got a burrow and two cows. I'm sure he doesn't care about the cows, but I'm sure he cares about the burrow. So, I'm getting off so I can videotape it, but also so I'm going to stand here until he calms down. Even though he's turned his head side to side, he is looking at that burrow because his some people don't think about it, but their eyes are on the side of their head, so they have to do this in order to see what it is. So they'll turn their head back and forth um, and they'll look at it with both eyes. And then when he doesn't care, they do stuff like this. Like now he came up on top of me. So he's licking and chewing, but he actually figured out, oh, it's not the death donkey, it's the friendly donkey. And I don't know if I can get a close up because, oh, you know, he put his head back down, but he's so cute. Okay. So now he seems he seem okay, so we're gonna get back on and try it again, and we're heading down the road. So we left the barn, we're heading towards the main uh, road, because the trails are kind of cruddy. So we just went by the burrow, the cows, uh, some pond, a little waterfall thing. He's doing good, but you'll see, even though I'm with one hand, I have contact on his mouth, because you can hear him snorting. He is scared, so I'm giving him confidence. I'm kind of holding him together, and I'm talking to him, and I'm breathing. Um, so, you know, even though he's scared, I'm relaxed. My body's not tense, so one of us, you know, is a brave one. So I'm leading him down here. Like, you're okay. We got gotcha. you. Um, you know, give him some confidence, and then we're going to ride all the way down the road. I'll give you some more video in a minute. Before I forget... Um, he's gating really well out here, so he's walking out. He's got a nice flat walk. This is more his running walk. So since he's got somewhere to go, um, he's actually moving out pretty well. And um, a way I know if the horse is like messing with the person or the horse is like really scared is when they go to the bathroom because if they're scared shitless, diarrhea comes out. And if they're not, they're just a little nervous, their um, manure is solid and he had a solid manure, so I knew I could probably take him down this road and uh, you know, he would be confident enough to do it. Okay, now we're on Salmon Falls Road. So um, he seems fine with the trucks going by. There's trash cans over there. He's moving around a little bit, but not too bad. Here comes a truck. Good boy, which is good with all that like spray of the rain going by. Fine. Um, so he's good with the cars and with the puddle noises. So now we're going to go back um, towards, there's bee boxes up here, so we're going to go to the bees. Okay, so now we're at the bee boxes. More cars going by. And I'm letting him graze. So the reason I'm sitting here letting him eat food by the bee boxes is to make those things not scary because he was a little nervous of them. And then also for him to want to come out on the trail because once he gets here, something good happens. And that's him getting a break, I'm off of him and him eating. But right now he's very calm and he's doing a great job for not being out or ridden for two days. Okay, so overall, this is what I think so far. Um, nice horse, he was scared, but he tries really hard. He seems to have a really good temperament. Um, he's gating really nice out here, so I think he's going to be well gated. You just got to learn how to ride him right, and he just needs to get his confidence up. And we'll see, of course, I'm going to take him by tons of other stuff once we really get on the trail. The bikes and hikers, and we'll make sure he's okay with all that stuff. But um, so far, he's being a star. Okay, so we're heading back home. You can see he's carrying some grass with him. Save it for later. He is smooth. We're kind of going downhill, which always makes them just a little bit on the pace here side. So it's hard to put the phone still and steer into all that stuff. But um, he's doing good. He's not going home too fast or anything. 